Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel Nadesh Creative Fitness. Happy Valentine's week everyone. It was Valentine's Day on the 14th and I'm a little late but I really wanted to celebrate love this week with you. Because love is not only for couples but if you are single, you're going to want to bring self-love into your heart and your body every day. And today we're going to bring ourselves love with the Bhakti Yoga practice which is the yoga of unconditional love. It's a practice that's focusing on opening the heart. So we're going to open the front of our bodies, the chest, the front of the shoulders, and stretch our spine into gentle back bends and also do some gentle hip openers for well-rounded, balanced, and calming practice. So go ahead and put your mat down. You can grab a couple of blocks, lit a candle. I lit my love candle here that's made of beeswax and essential oils, so I'm not breathing any chemicals. And let's get started. So we're going to start this practice with the Bhakti Yoga Sun Salutation, which are a little different version of the regular one. We're going to start at the top of the mat, with the feet right under your hips. I'm going to tuck my pelvis in, and inhale, cascade, open your arms wide, stretch your heart to the ceiling, and then inhale, bring your arms up, and exhale, roll down, press your hands onto the mat, step back into plank. Take a breath here. On your next exhale, bring your knees down, stretch your arms forward into a puppy pose, forehead to the mat. From here, I'm going to go down into a swing pose, elbows onto the mat, pushing the chest through the arms, lifting the belly, slide your hands down, and roll your shoulders back, coming up into cobra, and then all the way up to up dog with the knees above the floor. Exhale back to down facing dog. Inhale, right leg up. Exhale, right foot forward into your lunge and bring the left knee down. Push yourself back up, lift your belly in and then sometimes stretch your hips down. Inhale, open up the heart again, stretch your spine. And then coming back, exhale down and then back to down, facing down. Inhale, left leg up. Exhale, left foot forward. Bring your knee down. Bring yourself back up. Again, tuck your pelvis under and then stretch your spine. Reach up. And bring yourself down. Exhale. Back to down facing dog. Just walk gently. Tiny little steps forward if you can keep in your legs straight. And then bend your knees, relax. Charles pose, standing Charles pose. Bring it onto your thighs. Head is relaxed, and I'm going to slowly roll up one breath at a time. Bring my arms up, and I'm going to go back straight down. And again, extend, roll down. Step back to your flesh. Bring your knees down, perky pose. Lower the belly, inhale to swing pose. Exhale, down, press your hands down, elbows in, roll your shoulders back, cobra, and then all the way to up dog. Exhale, down, facing dog. Again, inhale, right leg up. Exhale, right foot forward. Bring your knee down, come up, open up the chest, and then lower down. Bring yourself back down, facing down. Inhale, left leg up. Exhale, left foot forward and lower your knee. Come back again. Belly, lower belly in and then hips down. Inhale, reach. Exhale, lower your hands. Back to down, facing up. Press back. Breathe here, relax your head, and then like little tiny steps forward. Charles pose, turning Charles pose. Slowly roll up, and we're going to do this sequence last time. Open the casket. Exhale, lower yourself back, roll back all the way, coming into a plank. Make sure your hips are aligned with your shoulders. And then bring your knees down. 
hips above the knees, curl people's forehead to the mat. And then instead, slide yourself down to sphinx pose. Slide your hands down. Push yourself up into cobra. Press your chest forward through your arms and then engage your legs for upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Sit bones towards the sky. Inhale, right leg up. Exhale, right foot forward. Lunge, bring your knee down. Inhale, bring yourself up. Open up the chest. Exhale, lower. Back to downward facing dog. Inhale, left leg up. Exhale, lunge, lower the knee. Inhale up. Open up the chest. And exhale. Downward facing dog. This time we're going to go into child pose here. Onto our knees, on the back. Take a few breaths. And then bring your arms back forward. Inhale, hands at knees. Exhale, downward facing dog. And then step forward again to the front of your mat. Standing child pose, back of the hands on the ground. Slowly roll up more from the breath time. Left foot with the left hand, 
and then stretch and open the chest at the same time. Lift, lift, lift. Press your foot, your big toe for balance, and then release. Fold forward, and then switch side. Left hand to the block, and then grab your right foot with your right hand, and then lift. Ooh, I'm having a hard time balancing here. It's hard to talk at the same time. Press your big toe and lift as much as you can. And then extend, coming down. Grab behind your knees and press your knees back. And slowly I'm going to come down onto my mat. I can download my mat here for my knees for camel pose. We're going to start by placing our uh, sit bones onto our heels. And then we're going to first do a half circle. So it's a preparation for camel pose, camel pose. So we're going to place the left hand onto the floor. Inhale, big circle with the right and I'm pushing my hips forward. And then I'm coming back down. Same thing on the other side. And coming back down. I'm going to lower my mat here, but you can keep it and again. Stretch it back. Stretch it back and again. Keep your lower belly in. Last one. And then push your hips forward. So make sure here you have held your tits. My lower belly is very strong and lifted. I'm going to push my hips forward with my hands. Imagine you have a wall in front of you and you want your hip bones to touch the wall. So push forward, squeeze your shoulders, roll your shoulders back, squeeze your elbows together, and then your head back. Do it here. And slowly coming back down. Sit onto your heels to neutralize your back for a second. And this time go back to fluffy pose, but instead of having just the forehead to the mat, see if you can bring the, the chin to the mat. If that's too much, just keep the forehead. And then slowly come back down. Swing pose again, lift, exhale, down facing dog, press it back. And then walk to the center of your mat, exhale, lower to the mat. And then we're going to go into um, our bridge. So first we're just going to do a, a passive bridge. We're going to go ahead and um, so roll back down, come up onto your toes, and then see if you can place the block onto the sacrum, right under the sacrum. If the small size side is too much, go ahead and put it on a big side, right? I'm going to go a little higher because I'm used to do this. And then you're going to press your feet flat. And then you're going to let the stretch happen. So here you can pause the video and stay like two or three minutes in this pose. And it's very relaxing. It's going to open up the hip flexor, the thoracic muscle, stretch your arms, stretch your heart in a very gentle way. On your next inhale, you're going to push onto the ball of the feet, lift up, slowly relax down. You're going to place the block in between your knees. This time, squeeze the block as much as you can and bring yourself up. Interlace your fingers and stay.
And then slowly relax down. Bring the blood towards you. Coming into happy baby pose. Press your knees towards your armpit. And then bring your knees together. And your knees towards the right. Look to the left. back to center, you can do a little circle with your knees, and go ahead and open your knees in one direction, and then other direction, bring your feet down, open to the butterfly, you can stay to your butterfly, or extend one foot at a time, Shabbat Take a big inhale to the nose. Exhale, mouth open. And again, inhale to the nose. Exhale. Inhale to the nose. Exhale. Let it go. Thank you so much for working out with me again today. I hope you enjoy this back to yoga practice and that you're feeling calm and filled with love. If you have any questions, please comment below. Don't forget to click the like button, subscribe to my channel and ring the bell to get notified for a new video coming out very soon, I promise. Enjoy the rest of your day and see you soon. Bye.